Welcome to the MTD Technical Corner. Today we're going to be discussing short bar feeders by the master of short <laughs> bar feeders, Mr. Martin Page. Now this is a real technical review into your short bar feeders and thank you very much for, for joining us on the uh, MTD Technical Corner. You're very welcome. Now short bar feeders is, is, is a big part of your business. You, you offer a full array of automated solutions, but firstly tell us about the, the short bar feed. Okay, so short magazine bar feeds uh, evolved in the early, early and mid 90s to be um, electro pneumatically fed, take up less space, automate very easily and very simply fixed head type machines. Hydrofeed have uh, tried to evolve our bar feeds to support the advancement of machine tools as they've advanced. We have to offer a range of short bar feeds to equally support that. So we still supply an electro pneumatic range, multi-feed up to 65 or 80 millimeters, which is a good proven workhorse. Traditionally, we're feeding, we're feeding bars into simple machines, three axis machines, single spindle machines. However, with the popularity increase over the past few years of twin spindle machine, it was incumbent upon us to grow our short magazine bar feed product range to equally support those machines. So the MSV range is where we're seeing most of our sales go into that kind of equipment. MSV 65, 80 or 110 and the suffix indicates the maximum bar diameter. The MSV is a bar feed that will support those equipment by being able to store bar programs it will work with the sub spindle, it will measure the bar, it will calculate the components in the bar. As the sub spindle pulls, it will count down, it will load the next bar, it has, it's on rails, it has an array of uh, technological equipment within, uh, available as standard to support that higher end equipment. And it's the MSV which we're seeing the growth area in our in our portfolio so you've identified the differences um in choice between the msv and the multi-feed um, now let's concentrate on the msv um, is there still a big market for short bar feeders in oh, the absolutely. uk absolutely yes there are yeah and, and let, let me make one thing clear you don't have to have an electro pneumatic on a single spindle or vice versa we put as many msvs on single spindle machines as we do multi-feed type equipment we're, we're, we're still seeing, we're seeing our, our market quantity grow purely because the buzzword here in the UK is automation at any level, whether it's a simple short magazine bar feed, a full length one, a robot or whatever it is. The UK is grasping automation for obvious reasons. I mean, I'm seeing many uh, examples of this out in the field where we've got a short bar feeder on a multitasking machine and then we've got one of your robots on, on the, uh, you know, in front of the door. So it's giving them complete flexibility, whether they're working with bar or whether they're working with billet. Mm. Um, talking about the range, you mentioned you got to 110 mil. Now, it, what kind of materials can, can you bar feed in, in that kind of size? Oh, well, the, 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 the MSV 110 is, 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 as you can imagine, it's an extremely robust piece of equipment. Uh, we're, we're installing them there's no restriction on it. We're, we're putting a couple in at the moment that are, that are feeding standard low carbon mild steels at just over a metre long and the magazine will take it and the servo motor is adequate to feed it. And it's, it's, it's not a problem. We, we've got those all over the world in, in our agents in Australia and uh, there's one going out to Estonia next week. So there we've got complete confidence in the product. And in regards to um, repeatability and, and, and kind of the rigidity, um, Let's start with the, the rigidity. Can you tell us how they're manufactured? It's a, it's a UK manufactured product. Most of our bar feeds are UK manufactured. We do offshore some of the parts for the MSV, we, we do, but they all come into Hydrofeed to be final checked and final assembled. It's, it's all manufactured in our work. Well, most of the parts are manufactured in our works at Milton Keynes and they are manufactured to a, a very high robust standard. The MSVs, as you can see, are on floor rails for clear access to the rear of the machine. Um, everything within it is, is uh, there's, there's nothing, no, cor no short corners, it, it, it's, it's all properly And the, and the programming? Programming is uh, on the MSV is very, very simple. 
choose the bar diameter, choose the, the material, whether or not you want to push to a stop or a position, and pretty much that's it. The bar feed will then set the center line, the bar will be loaded, measured, calculated the parts in the bar feed will simply count down with the machine. If the sub spindle subsequently pulls that bar, we will look upon that as a count, deduct from the component, another component from the bar length, and, and the, while there's bars on there, the cycle will repeat. And what does it repeat to, Martin? Is there a, is there a given figure? Yeah, we, we, can, we, we can feed a, bar, a full bar to a position. We, we're happily to within half a mil. Potentially it's better than that, but we have to allow for the end of the bar. To feed repeatability position, as long as they have a, a fixed chuck or a dead chuck, we, we're, we're within point one. And Martin, I think to me, it's, I think we've covered all angles on this. I think it's a it's a great product, and it's great to still hear that people are really embracing automation now um, in the UK. How should people get in touch? And are there any other features that you'd like to technical features that you'd like to tell our audience about? No, I, I just think it's important to be aware that whichever model you so choose, talk to us. We will best advise you on the application that we see fit. We'll never sell you something that we, we don't think is fit for your application. If, it's, if you want to do repeat work and you want to store that work and you simply want to call those part numbers up to minimize your operator setting, please go for the MSV. If you want a good proven workhorse that's gonna to feed to a stop with no bells and whistles on as it were, then go for the multi-feed. But we have something in that portfolio that will happily support you. Martin, it's been an absolute pleasure. So there you have it, the short bar feeders from Hydrofeed. If you've got any requirements whatsoever, contact Martin or his team at Hydrofeed today. Thank you.